to thank you uh, because of uh, helping us to start the targeted mass testing that we have carried out a couple of days uh, ago and the results are quite clear. So the cases that we have been seeing in Kiambu are uh, as a result of your support uh, to do the uh, mass testing. We also want to appreciate that most of our patients have been accommodated at KU referral and teaching hospital. But as we have discussed, we are ready uh, in Kiambu uh, to uh, accommodate uh, patients and judging from what you have seen uh, across uh, the uh, female and male ward and pa pediatric ward, we are ready, uh, not just here, but also in our other facilities um, within the county. As a county, we have about 60 beds uh, for isolation and quarantine uh, in our three level five hospitals, that is uh, Gatundu, Thika, and Kiambu. But we felt that it was necessary for us to get a dedicated facility uh, entirely for COVID. And Tigoni was a choice. We are now calling it Kiambu County uh, COVID Center. Uh, in this center, as you have seen, we have about 45 beds that are set and ready to receive patients. Uh, in the new wing that you have just seen, uh, we have the capacity of another 200 beds uh, so that within the county we'll be talking about uh, 300 or so beds. But we are also realizing that there could be need for more and a facility like this in Wangigi is going to be ready uh, to take uh, patients. So we are ready to do that and as we talk, we have some patients in our quarantine facilities. We have a capacity of 300 beds in our quarantine facilities at KMTC Dika, KMTC Karoli, um, KIST, Kiabu Institute of Science and Technology, which has a capacity of 50 beds, and Kikuyu University Campus with a capacity of 100 beds. And uh, as we talk now, there are patients who are uh, being isolated in, in, in our facilities. So ladies and gentlemen,